One of the most beautiful parts of Wisconsin is not in Wisconsin. It's a part of Wisconsin's peninsula that jets out into Lake Michigan. This is Door County. This is a little trip that Kelly and I have been planning for a little while now. We're not staying at a hotel. We're not staying at a motel. We're doing something a little bit different, but we'll still be really nice. Well, we made it. This is home for the next few days. Kelly's right here. Hi. And we have a, uh, what would you call this? Like a little cottage, I guess? Yeah, it's like Some a little sort of cabin cottage. Cabin cottage, uh, yeah. We're here cute. in Door County, just outside of Egg Harbor. And uh, there's so much to do this weekend. We've been talking about this trip now for weeks. A few weeks, yeah. yeah. So we are excited to get started. We're pulling in on a Friday night. It's uh, much cooler out here yep. than uh, central Wisconsin. Mm -hmm. We are, um, I'll show you on a map here, but we're on like a peninsula on the tip of Wisconsin, a little past Green Bay yet. We want to get inside and see what this place looks like. Let's go. Got our own fire pit over there, table. porch set up. This is where Kelly will be sleeping tonight. So when we left central Wisconsin today, we left about mid 70s and here it's low 60s. And tomorrow the high is supposed to be 85 back home. And here it's supposed to be about 70s. So we're getting that uh, cool lake effect. In this room, it looks like we have some uh, bunk beds going on here. So this will be the timeout room. <laughs> yeah, for you. <laughs> right? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> That's a nice little kitchen. Goes right into a little front room over there. Mm -hmm. And uh, oh, this is nice. We got a uh, full-size fridge too. So this whole place is really clean. Got a microwave over here. Stove top. I'll give you some coffee. Well, that's nice. We got a uh, toaster set up over here too. Got some uh, drawers. I'll bet they have silverware and stuff in there. Oh, placemats. Not that we will need them, but <laughs> scattered in there. Maybe they have them. And um, we've got elegant paper towels. So now, off the kitchen, we'll go into this room which is our room, and I have never seen a bed so low. Here's the interesting thing. My bed, you need almost a running jump start to get on back home, so. Look how low this is. It is. Here, let me show you how low this is. Look at that, it's right at my knees. <laughs> there, ready for the test? I like the white linens. You can see if it's dirty or not. All right, let's see if this is going to be comfy. Oh! <laughs> I heard how hard it was. <laughs> All right. <laughs> We need an urgent care already, five minutes into the trip. So this is your side. <laughs> it does come with pillows, so we are at a campground. We brought our own pillows to be safe. Uh, oh, they have sheets here as well. Oh, okay. okay, so we have sheets, we have a little, um, a little blanket. I'm going to assume there might be another blanket in here. No, but you, you can see over here, they get a, a nice little closet to set up, hang your uh, clothes or if you want to hide your duffel bag in there. And then we got some drawers over here to throw your, uh, you know, socks and undies in. Undies. Undies. <laughs> got a nice little TV. Um, air conditioner up here. This is kind of a nice touch. I do like this. You know, each, each side gets a reading light. They're pretty bright, so. And again, this is a campground that we're at. Yeah. Dive in like no, super, no, no. like Superwoman would <laughs> no. do. Just dive in. No. <laughs> All right, and then finally over here, it's a nice restroom. Huh? We got a fan going that we don't need. So we've got a nice clean sink. Hello. Got uh, a nice clean mirror. It's really clean here. Got the uh, commode. Oh, we got the uh, a double shower set up, so you get a nice rain uh, spout. And then a uh, nice, uh, nice uh, wand, I guess, to uh, make sure you're really clean. And, uh, and the, t uh, the shower itself, nice and clean. So all in all, I'm pretty happy with this place. What about you? Yeah. Yeah. I love how clean it is. And yeah. It's, uh, it's cute. It's very cute. And it's spacious perfect. for us. For a weekend, it's, yeah. it's uh, yeah, I like it a lot. I'm pretty happy here. So, we're gonna get our bags, we're gonna bring stuff in, and uh, we might check out a little of what's going on here in Egg Harbor. Like I said, it's Friday night with us checking in, 
and a lot of things are already shut down, but we'll uh, see what we can find otherwise. Coming up in the video, we'll check out more Vague Harbor. We'll be checking out some lighthouses. We will be on the Green Bay side of Lake Michigan. A lot of people get this confused here. This is not necessarily Lake Michigan. I mean, it's a part of Lake Michigan, but it's really Green Bay. Lake Michigan is on the other side of this peninsula. And, oh, there's that big windy road that we're going yeah. to try yep. and maybe find uh, that's made some national magazines as well. A lot to come up here in Door County, so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos. And do me a favor, this really helps me out on YouTube. If you would just take a second and do it right now, give the video a thumbs up. Let's go check out more of Door County. Raise your hand if you're hungry. All right, Kelly and I have both of our hands high in the sky, so it is time for us to grab a late night bite. And we were lucky enough to find this place as everything else in this area seems to be closed right now. Oh, and that reminds me. Have you checked out my merch shop yet? Some Halloween stuff in there too, check it out. So our wood fire pizza has come. What do you think looking at it? Done, but it does, we'll but see. it's a real thin crust. We have pepperoni, and it's not dark on the bottom, by the way. It's not burnt. So we have uh, pepperoni and black, black olives. olives. All right, we really couldn't do much of a review yeah. there because we were sitting outside and it was kind of dark. And I used the cell phone on my or the light on my cell phone to try and show you. So give you a better shot of the pizza here in a second. What did you think? It was just okay. <laughs> yeah, in my opinion, it doesn't taste as bad as it looks. But when you look at that place and the money they put into it and and all of their custom beers because it is a brewery and just a very nice ambiance there. Yeah. On a scale of one to ten, I think you said what? Like a five and a half. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, I'm kinda of with you on that, I think. <laughs> We've got plenty left over, so if you want any, come yeah. out to Door County. <laughs> Well, good morning from Egg Harbor in Door County. Well, it looks like Mother Nature is going to rain on us today. So we will make the best of it and let's get the day started with breakfast. All right, so here is what we have for breakfast. What did you get? So it's an omelet with um, feta cheese and spinach, tomato, some potatoes, breakfast potatoes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You already had a bite, did you like it? Yes. Very good. It's really good. Now I have just put together my French toast here. I just want basic French toast and some sausage. And um, it, smells good. it smells really good. And then we got our um, freshly squeezed orange juice. That was yummy. That was good. I didn't <laughs> I get to finish uh, talking about my uh, French toast in there. I thought it was really good. The only thing, I, I don't want to sound like a complainer. But I'm going to for a second. <laughs> the only thing is, it was just a, a smidge on the bland side. Oh. It, it, it was just, it needed a hint of flavor, a little bit more flavor. And I know maybe cinnamon or maybe more flour um, on top, or don't they do like powdered sugar sometimes? Yeah. French toast. Yeah. yeah. So, just a little something. To, but other than that, no, I thought it was really good. And uh, you like yours a lot? Yes, it was really good. Awesome. I haven't had a good breakfast in a while. It's been a long time. <laughs> it was good. We have made it to Gil's. <laughs> you probably shouldn't say that. <laughs> Take two. We have made it to Gills Rock. This is the furthest tip of yeah. Door County. We are at the end of Wisconsin. We are at the end of Door County. It's all lake back there. Now there's a little island called Washington Island. You can only get there by a ferry. And when we took a look, it didn't look like there's a whole heck of a lot going on today at least, or nope. nothing that uh, really jumped out for us. We are going to slowly make our way back towards some of the uh, towns. Oh, and that Shopping. winding road. Yeah. That's nationally known, that big windy road. We are going to find that. Found it, right over there. It's hard to see at the second. I'll get out of the uh, camera here, but it just gets really, really windy. And I think this is the only stretch, but this has made covers of magazines. It's nationally known. The windy road of Door County is right here.
right, we just did the drive of this windy road here in Door County. It's not as exciting on video. You actually gotta witness it for yourself and be a part of it, but the pictures that I'll put on Instagram look a lot better than the video. It's really impressive though. That road was pretty neat. So now we are in Sister Bay here in Door County. And this is actually out here. I know it's hard to see with the uh, fog and the clouds back there, but that's actually Green Bay. Not the city, but the it's part of Lake Michigan, but it's actually called Green Bay over here. On the other side of the peninsula and back by Gills Rock at the very tip where we were, that was more of Lake Michigan. So Sister's Bay is a real neat uh, spot here in Door County. Let's check it out. Kelly's been busy playing with filters on her <laughs> phone and then taking pictures of me while I drive. There's a filter of Kelly. Very cute. <laughs> me, not so much. Yeah, she, oh yeah, that would be a Barbie Maverick right there. Uh, I don't know who that is. Ken. Hang 10. Yeah, it's Ken, right? <laughs> That's pouting Maverick apparently and I've got some lipstick on I guess. Oh, there's baby, baby Mav. <laughs> Yeah, she's been... <laughs> wow! There's confused Maverick there. Yeah, uh, yeah, and there's uh, a girl. Miss America, yeah. <laughs> it's uh, crying. Boy, yeah, it's really Sad. played with my face there, huh? So. <laughs> now this I'm bummed about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're, we're bummed about this. Because you can see there's grass on the roof of this building. This is the uh, world famous Goats on a Roof restaurant. There's no goats up there. It was storming earlier today. So I'm guessing they took the uh, goats off of the roof. Usually there's some uh, goats walking around up there. I don't know where they go when they're not on the roof. This rain was not in the forecast at all, by the way. It was supposed to be sunny today, even as of this morning. So it's kind of a surprise and a disappointment to all of us. Yeah, I want to know where the goats are. Aww. What did they do with them? I'm sure there's a little like, barn or something. Go in when you know, it's not can't. storming anymore. I mean, just because it's a little slippery, you know, that could <laughs> yeah, be the uh, funny. special of the day or dish at that restaurant, you know. Goat. You, got goat. <laughs> you ever go to a restaurant and just stop and stare at somebody eating? Kelly has checked out a handful of boutique stores and we are making our way back towards the goat restaurant as I like to call it. Well, we can't see the goats, but they do have a gift store. It's a big restaurant, so I'll uh, at least show you what it looks like here. <laughs> Kelly is going to buy the shirt <laughs> with the goat on it. It says Door County on the side. Nice and soft, she says. L. Johnson's Swedish restaurant. That's where we are at right now. Yeah, see? That's what we should be seeing on the roof. Oh. <laughs> yeah, we found it. Can you go up on the roof? Or, just for the camera. It's a big patio area, huh? A little entertainment. Yep. Mm -hmm. So this is uh, the outdoor patio and outdoor dining for the restaurant. The uh, goats, I did ask somebody how that works. They're typically here by 9 a.m. They... Uh, come down about 3 p.m. and on days like today they just stay at their farm wherever their farm is and if you look over there right on that roof there's a goat camp and uh, here's a quick peek at uh, looks like their bar section and which we won't go in there it's pretty crowded right now it's just a bar in there and we'll take a quick look at the uh, restaurant and then we'll move on 
That's the best we could do for the goats. <laughs> There's the goats. Mm -hmm. And they're goats hanging from the roof today. <laughs> that was Kelly that said that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> looks like the goat got to her. <laughs> Needed some goat's milk. <laughs> is able to do. <laughs> check, check. Bryce, party of two. Bryce, party of two. Your table is ready. <laughs> now paging, Dustin, party of four. Dustin, party of four. YouTuber Maverick Hayes is here. Please subscribe to the channel. <laughs> well, Dustin went to his table right away. He was pretty prompt. Must have been hungry. We're still in the town of Sister Bay here in Door County, and we are facing Green Bay. And even with a cloudy, damp day, it still is pretty. Hmm. Let's go try in some hats. Get out before somebody hits you or something. Yeah. I'm trying, I'm trying. <laughs> but they're just kind of snotty to each other. Oh, they're trying to get to their, oh, their van there. camper van, huh? <laughs> they're headed off somewhere deep into the woods. There are a lot of neat stores here. Mm -hmm. And uh, more Fish Creek is in front of us yet, so we'll check those out. But it's, it's very similar to Sister Bay, but different. Um, I think a lot of the shopping is the same that you'll see in these towns up and down the peninsula. But the feel of each town is a little bit different. So when we've talked about Door County in the past, you've probably heard us talk about a fish boil and they are all over the place. And this is a restaurant that we'll be coming to later tonight. We'll show you what it looks like. If you're looking for a national franchise store here on the peninsula, you're not going to find it. This is the Walmart of Door County. Uh, even the hotels, everything is just ma and pa and independently owned and operated here. So there are no big national chains, which is actually kind of neat. So the two main roads here in Door County are 42 and 57. It's kind of a neat sweatshirt. I found these little postcards here. A fish creek back then today back then today today back then today back then there are parts of this area that are really hilly and uh, that house up there has a great view of fish creek and this door I remember getting scolded at the last time we were here. <laughs> do, you, yeah, do you remember why I was scolded? I don't no, remember. But I, can I remember imagine. being in there and being counseled. <laughs> I think I've been trespassed from there. <laughs> Can't go there again. <laughs> so we came across a spinning contraction here. Check this out. This is really neat. Okay, we are at the store that 
I can't remember for the life of me what happened the last time I was here. I'm sure it's something that Kelly challenged me to do and I did it and got caught. Right? Yeah, thought so. Let's go check it out and see if they remember me. You know you're in Wisconsin when you start to see the dead animal heads all over the place. Well, I think you like unplugged <laughs> something or turned an outlet. I off don't remember. <laughs> I just remember the store and the. I don't remember if it was the owner or just an employee, but somebody frowned on me. And uh, I said, okay, just walked out. I just don't remember what I did. <laughs> I do so many things. Right, and that's why we can't remember. It could have been something as simple as this. Whoops. <laughs> do you remember the last time we went wine tasting? <laughs> yes. <laughs> that was fun. It's on this uh, channel if you'd like to see what happened. Check it out. I'll put a link to that video in the description of this one. So we found this like barn right off um, the uh, water here. It's got, I was going to say graffiti. Yeah, it's just but people writing on it. People writing like, on it all yeah. over, yeah. And the whole thing is just covered. <laughs> some paint here and she is going to add to the graffiti my, my thought is maybe we should just start painting over everyone's <laughs> when we're done it's just a blue building yeah, this couple's already done you could see where the heart was somebody spray oh wow oh, that's fresh. nice yeah it's fresh oh, yeah oops. <laughs> maybe I could wipe this off on somebody so we have M circle K <laughs> mock <laughs> this must be a heart. <laughs> there, it's better. It's fixed. <laughs> M O K. Mock. Well, M heart K. Yes. <laughs> This thing's been here since 1868. That's all I've got for you. <laughs> Sorry. And that's all she wrote. Yeah. We left our information map inside the <laughs> truck. This is so frustrating, this rain. It's just so persistent. It's on and off. It's mid 60s here in Door County. It was supposed to be sunny and beautiful. We're making the best of it though. We are having a good time. I'm not sure how much further I'm going to go here. It's wet, it's slippery, and uh, 
<laughs> this tree is right on the edge. Look how clear the water is to the uh, lake down there. Not gonna go any further, although I'm basically at the uh, edge, as you can see. Um, <laughs> I am not going any further. Yeah, one step closer and this will be my final video. It is really pretty out here. Have you ever been to Peninsula Park or Door County, Wisconsin? Comment below, let me know if you have. And let me know your thoughts and what you did out here. I'd love to hear about it, so comment below. And then at the entrance of Peninsula Park, or for us on our way out, there's what I call the Jungle Gym. <laughs> I'm sure it's not called that, but it looks like a good time. So if you um, have a hard time walking or if you're a handicap, it is, uh, there's a nice ramp here and it'll just take you all the way across to get up to the tower up there. When you come to uh, Peninsula Park here, this is free to do with your paid admission into the park. There's no additional charge. And this is open until 11 p.m. We're about the halfway, maybe two-thirds of the way up point. just 60 feet above the ground. It actually looks a lot higher, but we are 253 feet above uh, Green Bay over there. There's uh, 100 steps that you climb up to get to the top up here. And then we could do this long ramp at over 850 feet. this on my cell phone again. I didn't want to bring the camera as there's lightning in the sky and we are outside. And so usually it's a fish boil, right? Yeah. Throughout the town. Yep. And at a certain hour they changed at this restaurant from a fish boil to... No, they do Friday night fish boil and Saturday night uh, Cajun boil, which all is the like restaurants? A Cajun seafood. No, this one. Just this one, right? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So, it's exciting. Definitely a Halloween effect. <laughs> <That's> crazy. <laughs> yeah, pull up your filters. <laughs> so, all right, let's walk around and check out the Cajun boil. We have great seats. We got front row seats. Yes, we do. Didn't have to pay extra either. <laughs> so he threw in lemons. He's got mushrooms. Mm -hmm. It's like a witch's cauldron there. Huh? <laughs> It's kind of making a shepherd's pie. And the andouille sausage. Throwing oh, and everything the andouille in there. sausage. That's like a true Cajun boil. <laughs> and now he's got the witch's brew. The witch's brew. <laughs> Without the bristles. <laughs> oh, yeah. ah. I don't know. I 
it again. <laughs> so this is their standard. What do they call it? Cajun boil. Just a Cajun boil. Okay, so I like that. Two ears of corn. So towards the end of this video, I'll have a lot of corn in my teeth. <laughs> Shrimp, celery, mushrooms. And then we go to the step up. And there's Kelly's lobster there. She's got everything else that's the same, too. Mm -hmm. She just upgraded. It's so, so tasty. Yeah? It has, like, the tiniest bit of kick, but not, like, overpowering, in my opinion. I'm not a spice guy. So, I'll be going through the Coke really quick tonight. But do you like the flavor? Tasty, I like the flavor. right? I do like the flavor. One thing that Door County is huge on is cherry pie. It must be like a, a lot of cherries that grow out here, huh? Yeah. 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 Well, they have. Wineries, Looks like someone sat on yours. Apple orchards. <laughs> Filling's Cherry coming out. trees. So it's all like fresh. So like, yeah. Yeah. What did you think of your Yum. dinner? She loved it. She was talking about it nonstop. It was good. It was yummy. You um, you did okay with the spices? Yeah. Yeah. It was a good spice. Kind of left you quickly. Yeah. But it was really tasty and yummy. My lips and were tingling. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a spice guy. I know. Kelly can handle it better than I can. I don't do spices very well. So, But after going through um, one, two, three, seven pitchers of water, <laughs> I think I did. <laughs> I'm okay. So the, the flavor, I'm with you. The flavor was really so good. So yummy. Yeah, it really was delicious. The uh, spice, though, <laughs> that was uh, that was tough on me at first I was like okay I could do this but as I kept digging in it was harder and harder for oh, me okay. yeah but it was good it was so delicious. if you are going to be in Fish Creek in Door County Wisconsin Kettle Black is the name of the restaurant <laughs> we're basically done with our Door County trip it was fun yeah it was it went so fast yep and now it's like a summer like day today we yeah. went from 60s and rain yesterday to low 80s right now and beautiful day so yep so, if you are into travel and attractions and all kinds of fun, goofy adventures, <laughs> subscribe to this channel. I would really appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Have you ever been to Door County? Comment below. Tell me about it. And you will see me on the next one. Subscribe now.